Hey guys, how's it going? Drip718 here. Um, I got another unboxing today. Uh, I did one of these about a week or two ago. Maybe, probably two weeks ago. Um, I got one on Craigslist. Um, and basically, what happened with that one is I actually... Some things kind of went down and stuff like that. And I needed some quick cash, so I ended up selling it. But, um... I did get another 360. Um, I ended up uh, getting it at GameStop uh, for 200. Um, it's the 4 gig model, which I know people are going to be like, "Well, dude, a hundred dollars more, you could have got the you could have got the 250 gig, or you could have got the Connect version of the 4 gig." But I mean, honestly, I don't really play all that many games. I mean, I do, and I saw this trick that you can put a the old 360, um, the old 360 uh, hard drives in there. You you just got to be really careful with it. Um, you got to take it out of the case and everything like that. You just slide it in there nice and easy. And like the twenty the twenty gigs are going for like twenty bucks at GameStop. And honestly that would be enough for me. I mean I think they're twenty or thirty dollars. And like I said, I mean it, it would that would be plenty for me. I mean I never use the whole twenty gigs. I mean I know you don't get the full twenty gigs, you get like thirteen or something. But still, I mean, I never used the whole thing. Or, I mean, I can get a 60 gig for like 40 bucks. I mean, I don't know how much the, the 250 gig hard drive is. Now, I did see um, they had a, a 320 gig uh, hard drive over there. The media, like a media driver, I don't know. But it was the 320 gig. It was a hundred dollars. So I'm guessing that the 250 must have went down or something. I mean, it'd be, it'd be kind of stupid to pay the same price, you know, for what, say, like 70 more gigs. But anywho, um, here is the Xbox itself. Um, like I said, I did get it from GameStop. Um, that's why they, they got this number over here. They got a number here that I guess, you know, to tell them where it is. And things like that. And as you can see, it is the 4 gig. Which, like I said, I mean, it, it's, it'll do me, you know, good for a while. Um... Until I can get another hard drive. I mean, I'm not really going to be playing a lot of games at the moment. I mean, I'm playing World of Warcraft and stuff like that. So, I mean, might as well, right? Okay. Let's see. We got start here thing uh, basically tells you how to set it up um, you got a wireless freedom thing here um, basically what this is is, t is telling you that you know you got actually you actually got uh, built-in Wi-Fi over the older ones which is pretty cool um, get your avatar the best insurance money can buy. Basically, this is, um, I guess, yeah, this is, uh, basically if you want to extend your, uh, warranty on your 360, this is always a good, a good idea. I mean, I don't know, really know how reliable these new ones are, but, um, I mean, I heard they were pretty good. You got these little things here that hold the holds the system in the place. Okay.
we go. This is the, like I said, I mean, it, it's the one that has the, you know, it doesn't, in all actuality, it kind of feels smoother than what they used to. I don't know, I don't know what all they did with it, but it actually feels a little smoother than what it used to. Kind of felt rough. The, the newer, the older ones, kind of felt a little more rough. Um, here you got a thing for the Xbox magazine, official Xbox magazine. Um, 24 issues and 24 game discs. 44.95, and you get 12. You get 12 of them for 25. This isn't bad. Anywho, we'll start here. Um, this right here is the controller. I mean, it's nice and black. Actually, they give you batteries for it, which is always nice. They used to give you Duracell. Oh, yep, there's Duracell in here too. actually get a headset also. You uh, you don't get a headset with this one. I mean, this is one of those bare bones, basically. Um, you just get the system and whatever you need to play it. Um, that's why it's only 200 bucks. Uh, it was either get this or they had a uh, 40 gig uh, PS3, which my experience is with the older ones now. I haven't been all that great. The fat PS2s, uh, I've had a couple bad experiences with them, so I just figured, you know, for ten dollars cheaper, I get a new system. I mean, like I said, it's not. It doesn't have all the the capability, the hard drive space. I mean, but it's still good. You know, for the money, it's still good. I mean, if you don't if you don't plan on using it for that much. I would get it. I mean, for me, the only real games that I play are, are RPGs, and then I play a couple, a couple of shooters like Resident Evil and stuff like that. But like I said, I mean, I, I'll get a 250 gig uh, sooner or later. I mean, I'll probably end up getting it used this way. I say with my Power Up Rewards card, and then it'll still be cheaper than getting, you know. And I have a, I almost have enough for a, a coupon at GameStop for ten bucks off. So, I mean, I can get, you know, my rewards card plus ten bucks off. So, I mean, that that would be even if it's a hundred bucks, it's twenty dollars off. I mean, that that would be cheaper than, you know, doing that. 
But anyway, I'm gonna go. Catch you guys later. Grab 7180.